is the show where we pluck out a name out of the famous podcast list, which is compiled about movies that we haven't seen before or we haven't seen in a long time. I'm your host, Edward Price, with me today. Boss Man again. Again. Different day. Different day. No, it's not. Today, we watched Arnold Schwarzenegger's The Last <coughs> Action Hero. You coughed over my intro. The Last Action Hero. Y'all seen this one before? I had not seen this before. I had not heard of this one until recently. I didn't know it existed. You saw it back in the day when it came out? Yeah, kind of, yeah. So it came out in 1993. Did you have it in the list, right? It wasn't on the list that you guys made, no. Really? Nope. We, we didn't mention this you one? You guys had a little bit more priorities to add to the list, like the Terminators and okay. other stuff that the I had not ones. seen. The, <laughs> yeah. the better ones. The last action hero is not a top Arnie movie. No, it's not. But... It's good. We're going to figure it out. It came out in 1993. It's PG-13. Um, and it's about uh, help with help of a magic ticket. 90s. A young movie fan is transported into the fictional world of his favorite action movie character. So what I thought that had happened in this movie before watching it, uh -huh. after of what I heard, is that I thought that Arnie comes out of the movie and spends the whole movie outside. Mm-hmm. What happens in this movie is that the kid goes in the movie. Mm -hmm. Then halfway through the movie, him and the bad guy and Arnie come out of the movie. I did not like when they came out of the movie. I liked when they were inside the movie. Okay. Um, what do you think about that? About the movie? About what I just said. Yeah, it would be better mo uh, better ending if it, the whole movie was the kid inside the... I mean... I mean, that, I guess it explains how Arnie can go back, but would have been Mamon? Okay, now I'm rewriting the movie. Uh, if if you spend all the time inside and then him, Arnie, and the kid get out of the movie and now Arnie is his dad. That's that's classic 90s shit. That's what I thought was going to happen. He's dead. Remember that the, the dad's dead. So yeah, you don't uh -huh. have a dad no more. Yeah, he, he falls in love with the mom. And then he falls in love with the mom. And I thought they're like, okay, Arnie gonna give that big old dick to the mama. Mm -hmm. It's a wrap. But that is not what happens. No. Arnie gets dropped in the world, and they afterwards, fuck. Afterwards, yeah. I, I because I recently watched Cobra. The, oh. This whole movie is a parody of action movies, and especially, and especially of Arnie's movies mm -hmm. and his friends' movies. So the first time you see Arnie, he is... Fuck, what's the name of the guy? Which one? Of Arnie. Jack Slater. Jack Slater. And he, he and he's playing... In case you didn't... Hopefully you guys watched this movie. But if you didn't... Arnold is playing... Arnold... And Jack Slater in this movie. Mm -hmm. There's literally a character in the movie called Arnold. And the Arnold in the movie... Our movie... And the last action hero is playing Jack Slater. Yeah. So, so they make a lot is, of fun is of Arnold. Arnold in the real world of the movie. Of the movie, and then it's Jack Slater. And Arnold is playing Jack Slater. Slater in the movie world. And Jack Slater does a lot of '80s action hero tropey shit. Mm -hmm. So the first time you see Jack Slater, the first thing I thought because I recently watched it. I'm not going to talk about it in one of these episodes, but I recently watched Cobra. You cannot talk about it. Nah. Fuck it. Watch Cobra. I'm gonna talk about right now. Watch Cobra, <laughs> and he's basically, that's basically Stallone, being the badass negotiator, walking into a building, and fucking shit up, mm -hmm. and that's what he was doing here. And I felt like he was parodying Cobra, in the very first moment. Was that true or no? <clears throat> well, it could it could be. I mean, because he's parodying everything else yeah. in this movie, which I kind of liked. Well, he, this movie was the first time he was executive producer, Arnold. Uh, okay, no wonder. Yeah, so this this the movie that after this movie the whole career went down. You think after ninety three? For Arnold? I guess he had done all the Conan's, he right? Was, yeah. But he was let's, let's add Conan to the list, Doug. <gasps> you haven't seen Conan the Barbarian? No. The Destroyer? No. Jeez Louise. Conan. Conan. How, how many Conans? Huh? How many Conans are there? Two Conans. Yeah. The OGs is two. First okay. one is the Barbarian. Fuck, fuck, fuck that. And, uh, the, oh, yeah. and the second one is the Destroyer. We're going to do Conans. If you guys want to see that, leave a comment down below. Yes, Crom. Uh, my dad loves Conan, but I just had to get out of here. 
as a 10 year old kid, you don't give Prom. a fuck, right? Yeah. You want to do Pikachu, right? It's different shit. Entonces, he was the ex executive producer in this one. The director is the same director from Predator. Mm. So he kind of, you know. But I like the story. It's it's straight up '90s bullshit, like a magical ticket that. I mean, I mean the the idea of of you never wish that you yep. were in a, one of favorite movies, yep. like you wish you were in one Harry Potter movies. Yes, of like course. Transporting the movie, I mean that's what I like the movie. Yeah, about. because you always dream of that, you know. You yeah. had a dream. Oh, I wish I could, you know. That's the cool thing about this one. Th that's why I thought the movie was a PG movie. I thought it was a kid's film. Mm -hmm. It's PG-13 yeah, yeah, and they're yeah. killing motherfuckers yeah. with it. I wasn't expecting that. Because right? he's an action hero, so. I get that. Mm -hmm. But the, the, the theme is such Saturday morning Disney Channel vibes of a magical ticket that transports you into a movie. Mm -hmm. I automatically think it's a kid's film. But then he's walking around shooting fools and his son dies and uh, falling off a bridge and all this extra shit. Yeah. I was like, well, this is PG. Let me look up what, what's the rating on this. It's PG-13. I was like, what? That's wild. Uh, there's a few cameos with little Richard, Tina Turner, mm -hmm. uh, his ex-wife now. Uh, <laughs> should we go back in time and tell Arnie not to fuck the maid? Don't fuck the maid, Arnie. <laughs> Don't fuck the maid. <laughs> Oh, and you're going to be governor of California. Yeah. Like, yeah. What? <laughs> um, but Arnold Arnold as Jack Slater is just maximum cheese. But yeah. the, unlike... The thing that, that this movie flopped is because they even shoot... One, they was to shoot in the movie one, one week before it was premiered. Man. They had a lot of time mm. editing because they had a lot of problems with the movie. I didn't, none, I, I didn't see none of the problem, really. Yeah. So as an Arnie fan, this is one of the worst of his of his career, you think? Yeah. I don't think it's that bad. I, I think mean, it's a fun movie. Yeah, it's a fun movie, but it's, yeah, he has better ones. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm shit. not putting up against none of that. But uh, I like that he's making fun of all of those movies. He's making fun of himself. Mm -hmm. And yes, there's cheese. But every 90s movie has cheese. But I accept this cheese over, for example, like a movie we did before, Kickboxer. I don't like that cheese. This is better cheese. Mm -hmm. And of course, if you throw in Sonya Blade, God damn. God damn. And some shorty short shorts. God damn. I didn't yeah. like that she was kissing the kid. That was a little weird and creepy. She was a daughter, right? Yeah, but she she kissed the kid when he opened the door and the lips. Mm -hmm. I was like, what the fuck do you want? <laughs> 90s. It's the 90s. The 90s. But that's like little baby face Sonya Blade, homie. Yeah. I didn't remember she was Sonya Blade, but yeah. But it's funny you see Arnold as Hamlet because he's the shit. You know, he's mm -hmm. the shit Arnie in the movie. Yeah, yeah, he's the shit. And it's just Arnie doing a bunch of different characters. And I, I, I mean, I had fun. He's parodying his old movies. Um, and there's some funny kills, like an ice cream cone through a, the one bad guy's head. That was funny. <laughs> um, it's just it's just a wild ride. I I, I thought it was good. Um, the, Sturm the Terminator Stallone in the movie yeah. world was funny. <laughs> yeah. I just took it as a fucking, they're making fun of Ar as Arnold, yeah. you know? <laughs> Like it's supposed to be, it's a movie world, you know? Right. Uh, so there has to be no Arnolds. And there's a damn, Danny DeVito plays a, a character cat. The, the drawn cat. I forget what his name is. You remember the cat? No. The cartoon cat who's sexually harassing the ladies. Oh, and, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he got suspended a week. It's fine. It's the yeah. 90s. There's no Me Too yet. Yeah. It's exactly. Danny DeVito. Yeah. And nothing, none of it makes sense. But it doesn't have to. You just shut your brain off and watch mm -hmm. this bullshit. And Van Damme is in this too. As Van Damme at the red carpet. Yeah. He's running around like, oh, yeah, I think it's cool. Yeah, look at me. I'm Van Damme. Because there was the, there was the 90s It's the 90s that, crew. Yeah, 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 I get it. Uh, it, it, was, it was, yeah, Arnold, Bruce Willis, and Stallone. The most action heroes. Did he do anything with, with Willis? No, Willis isn't in here, right? No, 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 and he says I'll be back, and he like he, he he's parodying himself. Yeah, but I just I, I wasn't feeling it too much when they were outside the movie. I liked the world that they had established inside the movie. I didn't want him to leave. Yeah, because he was the man in the in the movie world. In the in the real world, he wasn't. I mean, he's he was still Arnold. Hurt. Yeah, but he's getting hurt. You know, which yeah, I don't yeah. know how that makes sense, but okay. You just if if you start to dissect it, it's not gonna make sense, and it's stupid. I know, I know, but I mean that's why. In the real world, he wasn't the shit. Yeah, yeah. 
And the bad guy's Tywin Lannister, remember? Tywin Lannister, yeah. Vincent. It was Vincent? No. Something like that. Vincent. And he's pulling other people from other movies, which is, how do you know how to work the... How do you know how to use the ticket if the ticket doesn't exist in your world? Again, don't dissect it. Shut your brain off and watch it. I want you to think more of the stuff like, oh, Magneto's in this. He's deaf. That's cool. Yes. Magneto Magneto. shows up as deaf and he can kill people? Okay, (laughs) even though it's the real world, how can you kill people? Don't dissect it. (laughs) I remember if the ticket is to make a wish or or just you can use it to go in the theater. I remember. It's It's just a wish. It's a wish that the kid used to do that. Okay, but you can do any, you can have any wish, right? I think the the wish is activated by the the ticket. I don't know, but you can do. But the uh, sorry, any wish you can have any wish. No, you want. the the wish is is activated. It's to pull people. Oh, okay, it's, it's, you, and then you you need the ticket to do that. Oh, okay. So the the wish was to do that, but you need the ticket to do that. I don't oh. think the guy can make wishes with the with the ticket. It's a Houdini ticket. That's how stupid it is. Don't dissect it. <laughs> I know I, I'm, I'm super hypocritical, but for some reason, I dissected the fuck out of Kickboxer, but I'm giving Arnie a pass for some reason, because this is fun. Even though it's Arnie, yeah, yeah. and it's all about, look at fucking Arnie, muscle, yeah, ah, and he does all get to the job, bug it down. All yeah. the Arnie-isms <laughs> happen in this movie. Yeah. But well, because he's making fun of himself, I like it. Mm-hmm. I well, Arnie it. got better, better with, with movies, you know, too. Van Damme, not, not that much. Arnie got better with the movies, right? Mm-hmm. But he understands. I guess he understands how to. I don't. He he. So you said he produced this. Actually, pure, I think he was. He's a better producer than Van Damme. Mm-hmm. But uh, okay, again, this is like four years difference between these and, and Kickboxer. But mm-hmm. I didn't think it's that bad. Well. I know, like people hate it or, or regard it as stupid or whatever. I actually, it actually also felt newer than '93 when they were outside of the movie. You know what I mean? When they were inside the movie, uh-huh. it felt like a '90s movie. Uh-huh. When they were outside the movie, it did feel a little older. Older. Maybe '98, '96. I thought it was '96, maybe. I didn't think it was 93. 93 is kind of old. I was two years old. That's why I had not heard about this. Right. <laughs> but the poster is great. The, the poster is classic 90s Hollywood. Look at that. The boots. The boots coming at the shit. He's coming out the screen. The truck. That was a good truck. It's all cartoon poster like they used to yeah. do. The Mad Max and the uh-huh. everything. Yeah. I love that. Mm-hmm. The fucking font is great. It's a good Arnie movie. It's like, like Indiana Jones. No? Yes. Kind. It's like it's, it's an adventure. Mm-hmm. But it's very, very stupid. Okay, if you, if you again, if you try to right. dissect it, if you dissect it, it's stupid. It's stupid. But the, the idea is a good idea. The idea is a good. Now, would you want to reboot, remake, or whatever? And if so, who would be today's action hero, where you can make fun of him and he would make fun of himself? I don't know why the only, just when I said that, the only name that popped in my head was Chris Pratt. Or La Piedra. The Rock. You are correct, sir. It has to be The Rock because Arnie was the biggest of all time back then, right? Yeah. The Pietro's now the biggest of all time. That's a good one. I did not think of that one. Yes, yes, yeah. yes. Yes, you can make fun of everything. Yeah. Fast Five, the Scorpion King, yeah, the Kevin Hart jokes. He yeah. has his relationship with people. Mm-hmm. The Pietro. Pietro. Even though the Pietro has never had a su- success. Like Terminator. I remember saying this on the pod when 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 I was afraid that the Pietro was gonna make uh, Car- uh, God, 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 God of War. War. He's not. I think it's gonna be Call of Duty. Okay. But oh, he was saying. I see the news. He was gonna make a a video game movie, right? Mm-hmm, yeah. But I think it's Xbox. Yeah. Um. But what's the Pietro's biggest movie of all time? Like, the, if we're gonna have like a Pokemon battle, he being the lead actor. Yeah, of course. Also, like iconic movie, like Rick- Arnold is the Terminator and shit. Yes, Arnold. Okay. Uh, we're playing Pokemon, and my Pokemon is Arnold. In my Pokemon attack, he does Terminator. What's okay. your What's your rock Pokemon attack <clears throat> to beat me with Terminator? You can't. Unless, what is it? Fast Furious. No. Well, you don't beat me, but that's his biggest movie. You're not gonna say San Andreas Rampage. Jumanji. 
Jumanji's Jumanji over Fast and Furious. We can wait to Black Adam. I don't think it's gonna be as big as Terminator. No. If I type in the, the Rock, it don't come out after the Dwayne. Yeah. Dwayne. It might be Jumanji. The biggest. Like the most popular. The most for the, him. The most popular, the best, whatever you want to consider. It's not Red Notice for sure. No. I think it's about Journey. I, I didn't remember about that one. Journey? Hmm. Yeah. Maybe. It, it might be his damn song. <laughs> it's about drive. It's about about. Uh, Probably his wrestling career. You can make fun of his wrestling career. Am I am I convincing myself into getting a last action hero movie now? <laughs> Reboot. Yeah. Baywatch. Moana. No, Baywatch. No. San Andreas. Hercules? Who was Hercules? Hercules. He can make fun of Hercules. J.I. Joe. He can make fun of all of it. Yeah. Snitch. I don't know what that is. But it's funny he gets Fast credits Fast. for Wrestlemania yeah that's hilarious Tooth Fairy you Link can make fun that. of all of this shit I want a Pedro last action hero movie and he's 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 so good he could make himself funny mm -hmm. if he were to executive produce it he could do even a better job than than Arnie because that that WWE man, that that shit. Trains well, by then, him. well, right now, if you see count the movies, I think Tara has more movies to can make fun of him than Arnold back then. Right, and he he we already he is the highest paid action hero, action star. I can, right now, yeah. So whether we like so. it or not, he's the Arnold of today. So if you were to do this movie a remake reboot, Dwayne, 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 Pietro Johnson. And make sure if you were to do it, make sure it's a kid. I don't know how old that kid was in the last action hero, but he's a kid. He's a kid. Yeah, he's not a twenty-year-old no, guy like 14, playing a fifteen. Right. Yeah. Teenager. You know, and his daughter can be Zendaya if you want. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> but just don't make the kid Tom Holland or something. Make sure it's a kid. Fifteen-year-old kid. Yeah. Like the like the like the Ghostbuster kids. Those were kids. Yeah. We need more kid actors. Mm -hmm. You know. They get a lot of 20, 30 year olds playing, playing teenage, playing teenage yeah. you know? Like, I would be casted as like a 12 year old, you feel me? No. Oh, man. Not you. If you, if you shave, shave yeah. yeah. Give me two seconds, you must have it. Yeah. Goldie. I don't like that shit. <laughs> Let's get kid actors. It could be the kid from, from, from Ghostbusters. I like it. The podcast, the, the funny one. Mm -hmm. He could play like the, the all excited yeah. fucking all right, movie yeah, buff yeah. guy. And yeah, bam. <laughs> and then fucking go in there, right? Yeah. And make Arnie the old guy from the theater if you want to yeah. give, him, give him some kind of thing, you know? Yeah. And the, and the good thing, the cool stuff, it was that the kid, he was a big fan of the movies. And right. he's, he's telling him, hey, how do you know all this shit? <laughs> yeah. It could happen, but yeah. it only works if you if you don't dissect it and just shut your brain Play off. Along. It doesn't yeah. make sense, right? Don't make sense. Well, it does because it's a. I mean, of, it it gets uh -huh. explained, but no, no. But it's, I mean, it's, it's like a, a kid's dream sometimes. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm dreaming a lot back then. Yeah. It could be a. Even with a mija, you can dream of an actress. Anything, you know? anything, all that, all that. It's a, I I just had never seen it before. Mm -hmm. And if you were you in my boat, I enjoyed it, it. and more I than the other ones. More than the more. last weeks, last episode. More? Way more than any Ben Damme movie I've ever seen in my life. This is way better. But so if you were thinking about watching the last action hero, I say watch it. Give it a shot. It's a good one. It's a, it's a, fun, one. It's a fun one. But you have to shut your brain off. <clears throat> and if you already watched it, let's talk about last action hero down there in the comments. Let's have some fun. Um, and also leave me recommendations for future videos so we can drop more episodes of the list. Uh, I hit record this time so you can see me from the beginning. Sorry about last time so I can fuck up. Uh, but we're, we're doing this, Doug. Uh, anything you want to say to the beautiful people? Boss me. Hey. Good job. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share. <laughs> share. Oh, all that good you, shit. You share, click, YouTubes, Spotify, mm -hmm. iVox. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. All that good shit. iTunes. Make sure you stay YouTube. tuned to the pod to see what, what comes next. Uh, what, 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 what movie's getting added to the list? and we'll be doing 
uh, all that good shit. Always subscribe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With my outro. Always in favor of you, dude. Dude.